Waste management uses field effects on a daily basis on the field to capture uh, accounts, capture jobs, capture tickets that before we were doing all on a piece of paper, all manually, and also taking that information and manually entering into our building system. So starting with field effects has really allowed us to automate a lot of these tasks. We're just able to capture data that hasn't been captured before. Um, we're customizing it to where um, everybody has a, a piece or a buy-in at their own level within the organization. So from the executive committee that gets to see reports and dashboards, that way they know how to do, uh, how to run their business more efficient to um, making less work for our field operations. Uh, they don't have to do as much, much handwritten or manual processes that they did before. And we're able to get that information quickly into our accounting department. One of our major problem is the documentation. Um, getting the, the, the paperwork from the field, getting it into the office, getting it entered, and this way there's no room for error. If someone did a job and we're not aware of it, if they forgot to put it on their timesheet, if it's created on a ticket, then there's no way it can be lost and we actually know what we're looking for. Well, there's going to be a tremendous amount of enhancements, improvements, new modules and features that come out throughout every single aspect of the product. We know the reality is we build the product based upon what the customers are asking for and what they want to have in our product roadmap, but when they start using it in the real world, they actually discover what the product really needs to do. So instead of having a rather sterile laboratory type answer, when a customer asks, what does your product do, the customers are actually able to tell us and actually tell their fellow customers, here's actually the business problem we solved, here's how we solved it, and here's the business benefit we actually achieved. It's going to enable us, again, if we look at our process, if we look at ourselves internally and, and fix some of the issues that uh, a good revenue cycle will cover up. Now that the revenue is, is down, you look at these glaring opportunities and it gives us an, an, an uh, uh, the ability to address those, make the changes, implement a repeatable process that as we ramp up and, and go back into an up cycle, we'll be able to be more streamlined and efficient about our business. We have not lost any more tickets. It's been a great tool for everybody. It's made the processes much easier and we've been, been able to maintain the information and data that we're getting from the field. I'm most excited about what we're doing with the synchronization engine, making it faster, making it faster in almost all cases. So it's going to be some exciting times at Liquid Frameworks, especially with respect to the product.